Steve London with Big Frontier. We're discussing marketing nightmares, and today we're talking with author Paul Gillen, social marketing to the business customer. Paul just did a presentation at the Big Frontier uh, Big Idea Breakfast event. And Paul, I'd like to ask you, what are some of the mistakes and failures you've seen in terms of business-to-business -business companies attempting to make inroads utilizing social networks? Uh, the most common one I see is spreading themselves too thin. You know, the, the, goal, the goal becomes uh, to have a social media strategy rather than to have a business strategy that's supported by social media. You should never set out with the strategy of being in social media because you wind up making a lot of mistakes. So frequently I'll find companies, B2B companies, that have a big Facebook presence or they, they put a lot of resources into their Facebook page and they wonder why they're not reaching the people they need. Well, the people they need to reach are not on Facebook. It's not a good place to be. So I, I think that it is uh, more so than, than you know, epic failure. Uh, it is more so a matter of not really having a focus on the uh, on where the business opportunity is. Most of the time I advise companies do less in social media than you're doing now, but do it better. You don't have to be on every platform. Is there sort of everyone else is doing it so I'd better do it or else I'm going to construe it as being behind the curve type of mentality driving this? Absolutely. I hear this all the time. Our executive, our CEO says we have to have a social media strategy. And I say, no you don't. Uh, you don't have a strategy for office furniture, right? You don't have a strategy for copiers. Right? Those are tools that you use to get your business done. It's no different. Your what you, you need to understand the tools, you need to understand how to apply the tools, but your strategy should not be to use the tool. That is, should never be a strategy. You don't buy a hammer and then go looking, looking for things to hit with it, right? You buy it because there's a specific, because you need to drive nails. So baby steps for marketers, one step at a time, see what gets some traction within the marketplace, see what's working for you, make sure you find out where your customers, or potential customers might be before you, you take the time to start investment. With, start with where your customers are. Go where your customers are. And then if you have success engaging with them there, then look at other opportunities to engage with them in other places. But you always want to go where your customers are first. That should, be, that should drive your decision making, not getting to the platform. Paul Gill and Social Marketing is the business customer. Thank you. Thank you, Steve.